Welcome to my first LTB unboxing. It's going to be a good one. All right, let's get into this. LTB, this is my first LTB unboxing. Know why? Because I won it from someone. Let's see what's inside. First of all, I'd like to thank Nikki over at Bass Fanatic 432. I won this Lucky Tackle Box in a giveaway on her channel. Let's see what's inside. Alright. I don't think this is part of the Lucky Tackle Box. This is awesome. Let's check it out. Shady Rays. This looks like sunglasses. Let's try them out. How do they look? I'm going to wear them for the unboxing. Let's see what else is in here. LTB beer koozie. Want to get lucky? I already am lucky. This looks like a face shield. Red and white polka dot face shield. throw that on the floor right all right LTB face shield let's get decked out for this right let's see what else we got in this box a couple of stickers we got a card here thanks for being a lucky tackle box recipient Coupon Chad Pipkins Lunker Hunt's new super angler. What's a super angler? Alright, I gotta take this thing off. Did it mess up my beard? I got a golden ticket. I gotta watch the Lucky Tackle Box live stream. Maybe I can win something. Maybe not. It says join us on the 20th. 20th of what? All right, in here we have, let me get this out of the way so we can see the, there we go. Lunker Hunt, this looks like a jerk bait. I am a fan of jerk baits, so this is a good lure for me. Let's take it out and take a look at it. If I can get it open. The Kraken. Release the Kraken! It hooked itself. Well, the hooks are sharp. Hey, that's pretty cool. Golden Black. This is a lure that I have had luck with in the past. Not this particular brand, so I'm excited to try it. Spin 90. Dual Realis. This is a spy bait. This is a spy bait. I've never used a spy bait before. It looks kind of like a jerk bait body, but it has a little prop in the front and in the back. Let's get this open and see what it looks like. Sharp hooks on this one as well. All right, so spy bait, dual realis. I've never used one of these before. I guess you just cast it out and let it sink and then reel it in. I like the face on this. I don't know if the camera can pick that up, but it has that Japanese angry fish eye look to it. It's kind of neat. 
I'm excited to give this a try as well. Pretty cool. Big Bite Baits, Green Pumpkin, Coontail. Let me take this out, I can't really tell what it is. I'm just throwing all this sh** on the floor. Yeah, that's pretty cool, this is like a wacky, wacky worm of some kind. What is this? It smells like licorice. Anise. It smells like anise. I'm not exactly 100% sure what this is, but it looks like it would make a good wacky rig. Maybe, maybe even a drop shot or something. It's got a lot of ribs. It would hold a lot of scent. And it's very all over the place, this thing. It's pretty cool. I think I can get some use out of that, too. So far, this box is... Pretty good. What else? Pin edge mustad forat hooks. I'm not exactly sure what kind of hooks these are. Let me take one out and see. So it has some kind of little keeper up here. It might be some kind of flipping hook. I'm not exactly sure. I think that little keeper is for like to keep a worm. I'm gonna guess it's a flipping hook, a worm size flipping hook. You can tell because it doesn't have a wide gap. That's interesting. It might work good with this big bite baits. Let's see what else we got. So far, this box kicks ass. Bwa soft craw baits. Oh my. I do like my soft craws. Let's take a look at them. Alright, so it's a brown. It's maybe not brown. I gotta look without my glasses. It's like a dark red. It's like a dark red craw. Looks like it has good flappy appendages. Flappy, is that the right word? I do want them to kick though, as I drag this along the bottom. I'd probably Texas rig this. I think I could catch a fish with this. More. There are still more items in here. Unfair lures. Stick Minnow 100 Perch. This, again, looks like... A jerk bait? Let me get it open so I can get a better look at it. It looks like a jerk bait. It's got some really big hooks on it. I've never seen one quite like this. I think it's a jerk bait. It's got rattles in it. And it's got a nice glitter finish on top. And the obvious perch pattern with the uh, this has some kind of little foil or tinsel or whatever you call it right here to give it this uh, realistic gill look. It's pretty neat. I'll have to give this one a try as well. Ow! Did you see that? Hooked into my finger. That, these are sharp. Now I know why that rubber band was on there. Putting that one back in the box. The hooks are so sharp it hooked me. Still another bait in here. Looking awesome. All right, BD series. This is a Boyd Duckett buzz bait. I've never caught a bass on a buzz bait. At least not for the show. I may have caught one, I don't know, when I was a teenager, but honestly, I don't remember. So, half ounce BD series buzz bait. Let's take a look at it. What good is getting all this stuff if you don't take it out of the package, right? see what we got. Not bad. Pretty heavy. <laughs> Works like a charm. It'll be interesting to get this out there. See if I can catch one. Maybe if I mow this over the top of some weeds, right? With some braided line. 
pretty cool. Anything else? Yeah, we got some uh, bait mate fish attractant, which I have a million fish attractants up there, but maybe this one works better for some reason. Live game fish. Increased scale fleck in amino acids. I'm not exactly sure what I would use it with, but maybe these uh, wacky worms here, since they have so many ribs on them, probably hold on to the scent for a long time. This was an awesome box. Just to recap what I got from Nikki over at Bass Fanatic 432. I got these cool shades. They came in a little microfiber bag. Bait mate fish attractant. Which I will try with these big bite wacky worms. Ribbed worms. 4.75 inch. I also got these Biwa Warax. Warax Hyper Action Craw. This I am confident in right here. I usually do pretty good on Texas Rig Cross. Some must add flipping hooks. This crazy one. Unfair Lures. Stick Minnow 100. Looks like a jerk bait. It's got that cool tinsel or foil beard. It's like a little red beard. Red Beard Perch. Of course. Buzzbait. Very interesting lure here. Very interesting lure here. Dual Realis. It's a spy bait. Never used one. Anxious to get it out there and see what it does. And finally, the Lunker Hunt Jerk Bait. Golden black. It's got a little bit of orange under its gills here. Nice looking jerk bait. Oh, I can't forget my beer koozie. LTB koozie. Also, this LTB face shield. Thanks again to Nikki over at Bass Fanatic 432. Cheers. I'll leave a link to her channel below. Go check it out. Thanks for watching Realistic Fishing. Keep it realistic.